present the picture which the bird is expecting to see coming in to feed in its chosen field. And that is what we're doing now, presenting that picture. And it's got to be right. In the old days, it was rather easier to present a picture. I have actually done it with insoles from a gumboot. But nowadays, pigeons are a little bit more, what's the word, sophisticated. And you've got to get it right. And you've got to keep it right. So they've got to be, give and take, 35, 30, perhaps sometimes 40 yards away from the hide. And there's a good reason for that. We're using six or seven shots, which is the normal one one uses for pigeons. The, be the pattern is at its best at give and take 35 yards. So if the pigeon comes in over your decoys and you know it's there for 35 yards away and you go and miss it, it's not the fault of the cartridge. Nor the pigeon. Huh? Nor the pigeon. Nor the pigeon, exactly. Yeah, yeah, steady now, steady now. Yeah, I got you, I got you that. Ah, he's in the corner. Oh, yeah. Out of there, very nice. That's the nicest shot you've done today. Oh, I can shoot them. I know you've got pull cuts. Do you get them crossed? Do you cross them? No, no. We, we, we try to keep the whole cat to pull cat, Jack, and uh, you know, albedo to albedo. You know what I mean? Find them. Find them. What's in there? Find them. We'll go straight to you the bullets. <laughs> Look at them little work in it. We'll give this one a try, I think. I'll tell you what, they're very quiet for Jack Russell's. Oh, yeah. yeah. They're very noisy oh, in the car, though. That's really trouble. They're all right. Running out working. They're okay. When I was a kid in the countryside, it was heaving with rabbits. They were netted, snared, shot, and even gassed. Is that what I, you mean? I've always had a thing about them that I've seen people, have, well, I've been with myself yeah. a couple of times with them. Yeah. They ones look very quiet. So. Yeah. It, How do you manage to keep them quiet like that? Oh, right, that. Shall, you, shall you bring them up? What, keep putting your finger in the mouth? Yeah, from being yeah. young. From young. Well, she had a little bite of you there. Let's have a hold of it. Yeah, oh, it's, oh, it's, don't have a bite. Don't have a bite. Don't, don't bite, Jack. Well, I won't, I won't have trust a you. Hey, get out the way, mate, too. No, I'll Just try it, Jack. Just try it. No, Straight oh, up. I'm not going to try it. I'm not going to Yeah, your finger in, it'll not bother you. But we've managed half a dozen, Ken. Yep, yeah, it's not so bad. Lovely we'll, we'll rabbits as well. We'll do for a start. Yeah. Do for no, a start. No yeah. mixing at all. No, no, no. no, no Clean as a whistle, that one. Every one of them. Lovely rabbits. Big fine things. Holland is so flat. And when you see uh, high birds here, it's, it's amazing. Yeah, you think they're out of sight. <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> But just like that, you know, yeah. <laughs> little crosses in the sky. Yeah. One wood cross. Thank you. That means you buy the first drinks. <laughs> yeah. That means you buy the first drinks. Yeah. Did you bring money along? Yeah. Because it <laughs> cost you around.
But yes. Look delicious. And the spuds and cauliflower. A little cauliflower. If you like, I should advise you to have a little bit of this rowan and apple jelly, which is, goes very well with it. Rowan and apple jelly. Yeah. Let me try this picture. You try jelly. that now, Jack. See what it's like. You better say it's good, otherwise my wife will shoot you. <laughs>